Hey, how's it going everyone? This is your energetic and sassy YouTube expert, Daryl Eves. Now, I'm always trying to improve my workflow on YouTube because I do a lot. I actually upload a lot of videos and YouTube actually has some internal things that can actually speed up the process. Plus, at the end of the video, I'm gonna show you a tip to do multiple templates to really speed up the process if you do a lot of uploading of videos. So if you're interested in being more efficient on YouTube, then you need to stay tuned. DarylEves.com. Now there's several things that you can actually do to speed up your workflow. Now, one of the things that we all do is upload videos. So let's go ahead and hit upload. Uh, well, let me pull over a specific uh, video. So the first thing is if you title your video the same as the title in here, it automatically preloads it. But you notice here that my description has a lot of information in here and I also have tags. And if you look closer, I already have some monetization settings and advanced settings that are there. So what I'm gonna show you is how to actually change this and have your own default setting of when you actually upload and save you a lot of time. Now to do this, we need to come in the upper right hand corner, click on the avatar icon and then creator studio. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and leave that page here. We'll let, let that fill. Um, and come over to uh, channel. And under channel, we actually have a place called upload defaults. Now this gives you the ability to anytime that you actually upload anything, that there's a default setting that it's going to happen every time. So the first thing that I want to do is make sure the privacy is set to private because I don't want anything to go to public until I have time to uh, manipulate the meta information. You can set your category and choose your different category and then your licensing and so on. You can also add a few things in your title. So if you always have something like, if I always have Daryl Eves in the title, uh, anytime that I upload, um, it will always have dash Daryl Eves in it and then all you can do is save some time on the title. Um, I don't necessarily do that. I actually put the title in the name of the file that I'm uploading. And you can see right here, um, I have a description. So this is the description that I've been using. Uh, you notice there's a space right here because that's where I actually put some more information in the description uh, to help personalize the video and I do it at the very beginning as well. So you can actually set default tags. Okay, so you can put them in quotes if it's two words that you want for one tag or one word, you don't need to necessarily put them in quotes, but look, you can literally put your tags right in here. So if you have constant tags that you actually do, that's great. And then also you're able to uh, do this as well where you can actually put other settings like comment, rating, monetization, your ad forms, your video language and so on and so forth. And I always actually put video location in there. That's just a little optimization tip that you might wanna consider. So here's the, a way to actually do it for one of your upload defaults. Now, the thing about it is with a tool, and this is a tool that I love, it's called TubeBuddy, and you can download it for free at tubebuddy.com forward slash go. I also put a link to TubeBuddy in the description below. So with TubeBuddy, you can have multiple profiles. And so, for example, we have our one profile. Let's create a new profile, and it's gonna say, okay, what, what do you wanna name this profile? I'm gonna just go ahead, Daryl Eves, and we're gonna call this um, main. Okay. Okay. So we actually have a profile now. Check this out. I want to be able to add some other information in here. Let's go ahead and take this out and put this as a test. And let's go ahead and add another tag test. And we're going to create new profile right up here. And I'm going to go ahead and put um, test. Okay, and you can literally have as many different profiles as you want. Now, here's the thing. If you are a certain type of creator that put out a lot of content, you might have different description for the types of videos you put out. This TubeBuddy tool gives you the ability to have multiple profiles. Now, let's go ahead and I'm gonna go ahead and hit save. And um, once we're gonna go from there, I'm gonna go back to upload something. Great, now we're gonna ha actually leave the page here and I'm gonna go back to upload. Um, so I'm gonna upload the same file here real quick. And you notice that it automatically puts in the default information. Um, uh, over here on the left-hand side, I can actually select the type of template. So I'm gonna go ahead and change that out, hit apply, and you can see that it pulled all this information in right here. And honestly, um, having uh, you can switch just back and forth and just pull this in. The great thing about this is it gives you the ability to have a limited amount of default profiles that you're actually creating. And so if you have five different uh, video types and you have different types of 
uh, meta information that you use for each specific video. This is a great way to speed it up. Also, too, um, for vloggers, this is going to be great. For gamers, this is great because it can really pull in and save you a lot of time. Man, I just love this tool. And if you uh, haven't downloaded it yet, go in the description below. There's a link there. Uh, this tool has literally helped me speed up my process. It really has created systems. I just love it. So I have a lot of videos coming out that's gonna talk about how amazing this tool is. There's a few videos right over here that show you different things that you can actually do with TubeBuddy. And honestly, guys, if you haven't subscribed, what are you waiting for? It's time to subscribe, time to check out a few videos and be more effective on YouTube.